Hi JP. Hi JP. Hi. So I've heard you're going back to showbiz. Yeah. So for I know how many years have you been out of showbiz? Uh wow. That's entertainment. Yeah. It's no longer that. Nineteen nineteen ninety four, ninety three, ten years and that's it. Uh, and ninety six. Since nineteen ninety six. In and out naman, uh, mm. a few guestings here and there. Mm. Uh but mostly behind the scenes work. Uh, I was doing some, uh, I was directing for some music videos, okay. and then I was doing post production work, which okay. was editing for GMA QTV right. after some time. That was, yan, yan, yan. So basically, hindi ganaan pala talaga na wala sa showbiz. You're working behind the camera. Ah, uh, oo. Kasi marami, I, I, for a time, I was really uh, busy sa QTV. Eh. Alright. Tapos, after that, medyo yun, na wala talaga ako. Mm-hmm. Yung, uh, mga seven years siguro. Uh, okay. Seven years. Mm-hmm. You're really known as a, as a showbiz child, child star in the 80s. Yes. So can you describe the that time? I mean, going back, we we'll just do a little. I think the eighties were just really uh, very glamorous. Because uh, you got to work with a the lot best. of the yes, the best, and then um, uh, looking back, no, uh, watching the films, uh, they were showing mga batang yagit uh, just a few weeks back. Okay. And as I was watching it, I was like, wow, I was working with Bembo Rojo, uh, Charo Santos, mm-hmm. before before she you know, she headed ABS, uh, Jay Hilagan was there, Ami Austria. Okay. So I had the privilege to really, you know, mm-hmm. to work with them and then to learn from them. And I think the golden, siguro yung mga directors also were, I was very blessed to work with, with some of the best directors back then. 